Hello, this is Pedro Lopez from PayWithPedro.com. Uh, today I just want to shoot a quick clip kind of going over a little overview of how to set up custom audiences using Facebook. Basically what you can use this for is if you have a website and you're sending visitors to the website but you're just not really getting conversions and you're not really getting what you want you can actually give you know get a second sh second shot a second chance with these visitors by putting that website in front of them again just by tracking their visits and Facebook allows you to do that so basically what you would do is you install a, a Facebook uh, a tracking pixel on your website whatever uh, whenever you get a visitor that visitor gets tracked and in, into into what's called a custom audience and then what you can do is you can, shoot, you can post an ad on Facebook targeting those exact people that visited your website before. So that gives you pretty, pretty much a second shot of them coming, going into your website for whatever you need them to do there, whether it's to make a sale, whether you know, you're know you advertising something, for anything you want them to do. So you just kind of get your, put yourself in front of them. And you know everybody is, all, is always on Facebook, so you will be in front of those people that visited your website even though they left your website. They will, they will be seeing your website on their Facebook, which really increases their chances of going back in there and visiting your website again and possibly leading to sales. So basically what I did is I created a pixel, a tracking pixel for paywithpedro.com. I call it a PWP visits. I'll show you exactly how I did that. All you do is you go here on, on the green, basically, just to show you where I started. You, um, so go back to step one. Here's your ads manager. All you go is you go to the last one here. So this says audiences. And it'll show you uh, the list of all your uh, your of all your custom audiences that you have created. So basically I already created PWP visits, but let me show you exactly how I did it. I go into the green button, create audience, and you click custom audience. You go to the middle one here, it says uh, website traffic. You have this set to anyone who visits your website. I put my domain here. Whichever domain you want uh, you want to be here. Uh, I had it at paywithpedro.com and you can uh, you can set it to how many uh, in the last 30 days I have my set to 60 actually and you have this checked include past website traffic once you have all that filled out you just hit create audience and just to show you real quick this actually gives it the option to for specific web pages on your website which is pretty cool so but right now we're just tracking everybody everybody who sets foot in paywithpedro.com or in your case whatever website you're trying to drive targeted traffic to. And remember this is targeted traffic because these are previous visits. So once I hit that create audience, your audience will pop up right here. And once you have once you see it here, you need to install the code into your website. Now this is where most people kind of get stumped and get a little frustrated because a lot of people don't know where exactly that code goes. And but I found a way that really facilitates that it makes it really really easy and I really did all uh, just real no hard work with this so all you do is just click here select your audience you hit actions and you click view pixel now I don't want to go down and show the code because there's uh, you know, sensitive information in there but basically what you do here when you want to scroll down you see the code there you select it and you copy that code now the question is where does it go well, what I when I, what I, when I was looking for that, I actually stumbled upon a really neat plugin that's called uh, Tracking Scripts Manager. I actually have the link for this below this video. All you do is you install this uh, this plugin into your WordPress website, and right now I'm actually posting this blog post at the moment. So let's just. Let's just, here we go. Let's just go into the new tab. Okay. So, once you install that plugin, 
or you do or, I mean, go to the whole process with you. You can you know, add new plugin. Go to plugins, add new plugin. And you would search for tracking scripts. And you will see that the plugin will pop in here. I already have mine installed. You just hit install and uh, your plugin will be installed. And it'll, it'll pop up in your little tab, uh, your little menu here to the, to the left. And here it is, tracking script. So basically, if you have that, uh, that code from your Facebook custom audience copied, all you do here is just, just paste it right here and you're done. Just give it a name. Let's call this like I did before, or PWP visit, and that code you found right there, that code you found right right there in view pixel, that code right there that you copy, you just paste it right here and you click add scripts, and you are done. From now on, every time somebody visits your website, Facebook will track it, and once you set up a Facebook ad. And you want to, uh, you know, uh, attract those people back to your website, or you want to send an offer to those people. I mean, they obviously have some sort of a bit of an interest for what you're offering because they've been to your website. You can actually track them again for whatever you're promoting via Facebook ad. So it's very, very laser targeted to the people you want, which means less spent. You're spending a lot less on ad spend, and you're getting the people you want uh, seeing your ads, and you're getting clicks. And you're getting in your chances for sales are a lot higher. So this is a simple, simple way of, of making that happen. It really just took me no more than five minutes to do. All you do is set up your audience, grab your code, install tracking scripts manager, and copy that code right here, and you are done. The next time you set up a Facebook ad, you will have a highly targeted audience that will see that ad. All right. So this is it for this video. I hope you learned a lot from this. Uh, I certainly, uh, I'm, I am using this a lot right now and really helping me out. And uh, I hope it helps you out too. So this has been Pedro Lopez from PayWithPedro.com, and I will see you in the next video. Take care.